Welcome to Beer Stars from Beer Star Brewhouse. This video is about the, the difference between uh, Lutra Quaik, which is a pretty clean fermenting Quaik yeast, and uh, a traditional lager yeast. Is there a difference? I brewed almost identical beers. It's a double bark, so it's a very clean beer. Um, and I used Quaik, Lutra Quaik, in this one. Um, Lutra Quaik is supposed to be the cleanest Quaik. And over here I used a Nova Lager. But is it clean? Um, no, <laughs> it's not clean. The aromas, the aroma of the Nova Lager is... is eh. Yeah, it is very clean. It's a little hint of caramel, a little hint of uh, rye bread or, or bready notes. Not rye bread, because you Americans, you think rye bread is, is something entirely different than it is in Denmark. Um, so it, this one is bready in the aroma, it's caramel, and this one is uh, it's a little bit fruity. There's caramel in also. Yeah. But it's fruity. It's, uh, yeah. It's definitely not clean like this one. Yeah. The same thing about the taste. I can taste this kind of a double buck, um, but I got this yeast profile, I got this fermentation profile that's kind of fruity and uh, it's definitely not a clean beer. It's, if I was to blind test this, I would say it uh, was somewhere in between a brown ale and a double buck. And I get the yeast in the aroma, I get the yeast in the in the flavor. Still a great beer. But oh, this one is just so clean the aroma. The taste is super clean. It's a little bit bready, it's a little bit caramelly, there's a little bit of licorice in there, but no yeast profile whatsoever. Super, super clean. And the sweetness comes through in this as well. It gets cut off by the by the bittering hops, but but yeah, but it's it's there. This one is a little bit too too muddy to to actually get the the sweetness so clean like it is in this one. And this it just comes through as a some kind of fruity flavor. I would call it a <laughs> it actually tastes like a home brewer who didn't have control over the temperature. So the yeast profile just took off in a different direction. I mean, it's a good beer. It's just not a double buck. Not really a double buck. This one is an amazing double buck. Yeah, cool. So if you have any questions about this, um, yeah, write to me. You can see the recipe for these beers over here somewhere, and then uh, try to play around with these. That's always fun. Um, yeah, I guess that was it. Have a have a brewing out there. <laughs>